exactly 30 days, 30,000 generated from the store, which is, has zero sales from months ago. If we just found this product, we believe on that and we start testing different strategy, actually one strategy, but different ways of that to make sure that it will work out when we have seen the data from TikTok, which I'm about to share with you. Hello to everyone, Anatoly is here and today I'm gonna to be sharing with you how exactly we were able to scale the store from zero to $30,000 in less than one month by the generating over 39% profitability for this store. Uh, we were using TikTok advertising with ChatGPT. I'm going to be sharing with you everything, the, the testing strategy, the exactly how we were able to bring such a profitable results and I'm going to be see, showing to you my screen and all the store and data from that. So let's get started. So guys, now we are in the store. This is the Shopify dashboard. As you can see today, we have been done already 300 hours in sales. It's like mid of the day. So far yesterday has been generated 1,152. Day before that, 1,755. From the first uh, till today, it has been done 24,600. So the, basically when we start testing this product in this store, it was 20 of January till today it has been generated $28,900 in sales. So that's basically the just simple dashboard. I wanna go to an analytics with you. I wanna go to True Profit app where you're gonna be seeing all the analytics from the past and day by day, I'm gonna be explaining the strategy which we were using uh, in the TikTok and what's allowed us to make this kind of results. As you can see, we even haven't been started scaling. It's just consistency on the TikTok, which we were testing the different creatives, find out what's working the most. And now winning creatives, we're gonna be combined together to be able to start scaling to over three, five K a day but first of all i wanna go from scratch we go to analytics so as, as you can see from january 20 to february 20 let's go like even february itself to show you so this is 24,000 as i was showing, showing you before has been made we're going to 20 till 20 so as you can see Average conversion rate 3.9% and have been made $28,925 in exactly actually one month. To the end of the day, I'm more than sure that we're gonna be reach this 30K. So exactly 30 days, 30,000 generated from the store, which is, has zero sales from months ago. If we just found this product, we believe on that and we start testing different strategy, actually one strategy, but different ways of that to make sure that it will work out when we have seen the data from TikTok, which I'm about to share with you. Here you can see that 3.9% conversion rate, it's quite high for the drop shipping. But for now, we have decided uh, like a month ago, we made a decision that it's gonna be our actually KPIs now that we have to be over 3% all the time since ChatGPT have been created. If you haven't seen the video about ChatGPT from my end, just uh, press on the link on the right or left side from on this video and you will be seeing exactly the basic steps how you can increase overnight your conversion rate in your store because we were done that several times now in the stores and it's really doubling even in some of the stores tripling the conversion rate by implementing the hooks and ideas with ChatGPT helping us by just generating it from our cases which we providing to the machine. So this AI machine allows us to make the conversion rate 3.9% on this store, which is obviously showing that it's high profitable results, which will go now to the true profit app, where you're gonna see all the details. Every shorter value 5161, where is the selling price was 49.95. As, as you can see, every shorter while, not that big, but when we have seen the super high conversion rate and profitability, almost 40%, we have decided we won't be really tested several things in terms of upsells since, since it's super profitable. Uh, there is doesn't make sense to do that. We tested once, we tested twice. We didn't see the significant results with the upsells, but we have seen that conversion rate, it's, it was just like awesome. So we decided do not really touch it. As you can see right yet, since we are not scaling, it was just a, like a method of testing to find out the creatives and all the stuff which is working. We haven't yet even run in the retargeting campaigns. It's all from the old, uh, from the cold traffic, nothing else. So that's the beauty of this particular case. No use even the warm data, which is already customers who warms. When we launch the retargeting campaign, SMS and all marketing, you will see the significant 
return rate of the customers and plus obviously it's going to be even higher profitability in this case i want to go now to the true profit to show you more the main country which we were targeting it was canada and us basically that's the most important things to know like conversion rate average order value everything is here in front of you but i'm really more interested to go to the true profit from february 1st till february 19 revenue has been done 24 000 with the net profit of nine thousand dollars which is 37 percent in average profitability you can see it's just february i want to go to the beginning of our testing phase which is 20 to 20 so exactly one month 28 9 25 39 percent average uh, margin which is net profit for this particular pro product in the first months in this store we have been generated eleven thousand dollars in pure profit so here is cost of goods 5,700 that spent 10,586 as you can see transaction fees it's 1,186 and uh, TikTok ads only as you can see running here all the data is available exactly on this uh, sheet you can see like shipping charges all the stuff which is matters so let's go now to day by day and i'll explain you what exactly we have made to be able to generate such kind of results so i will explain you our testing method method on the tiktok so on 20 of january uh, our media buyer launched the campaign in the tiktok and it hasn't been profitable but the thing is with the tiktok when you see at least one sale in the campaign with tiktok especially not especially actually in tiktok itself always give a shot for another day our main criteria on the testing phase when we see the sale on the first day we are just give it a shot for another day to see if that's gonna be giving us better results tomorrow because tiktok sometimes surprising you actually most of the time surprising you uh, on the second or even third day with the sales so basically we launched the campaign it was abo campaign we were using aco method method where was three ad sets each ad set was 30 dollar budget so it's three by 30 the ad level we had in each ad set 15 different creatives which is, was three different videos with five different texts so by using aco method we created 15 different variations of that kind of creative and text and in each ad set we were using exactly the same ads uh, variations so when we launch it uh, the first day uh, the ads has been spent 44 dollars so it haven't been spent a whole amount but 44 dollars has been spent and 51 generated so average ROS was 1.15 obviously not profitable our break-even ROS on this product is 125 cost of the goods for this particular product is 10 dollars we haven't done a 1025 cost of the goods so like correctly and plus the transaction fee as you can see so we were not profitable we lost like five bucks on on this day but we got a sale it's made us like green light let's test it out for another day so what we have done we just killed everything uh on those three ad sets we just killed the interest which were not performing that well and decided to keep it the rest of the creatives for another day 21st we haven't got any sales uh, we actually now i remember first day we haven't touched it second day we decided to kill the uh, ads which were not performing and we went to the 22nd uh, so actually it was three ad sets 15 ads in each ad set on the day number two by end of the second day we decided to leave one more day and kill it what that what was spending money but wasn't performing so actually this is where we went on the second 22nd of january and this is where magic begin we got 50 dollars revenue 75 spent okay like fine we got another sale now we're gonna be keep it for another day and uh, see what's gonna be happening on 23rd of january boom 120 spent 260 made because we let tiktok optimized so after that when we have seen that kind of performance uh, we decided to create the separate campaign exactly the same with the winning interest which we had these three ad sets had a couple of the interest inside and uh, we have choose the one ad set which is what giving us the first sale and second sale it came from the same ad set so we duplicate that ad set with the winning interest and uh, that there was interest healthy lifestyle we just duplicated to separate ABO campaign and in the separate ABO campaign we decided to go with and tested out the uh, bid strategy and made it four different ad sets of exactly the same interest with the winning creatives only where it was the bid ten dollars fifteen dollars twenty five dollars and uh, thirty dollars we generate 53 percent net margin 
uh, with the $140 profit for this particular day and then we went to 24 and it happened 162 since we launched it it haven't spent all the budget but 162 we spent 400 made made 60 percent net profit on that day and we went to another one and another one was 119 249 52 percent net on those campaigns so the, by that being said 22nd to 31st we have been generated 4227 1864 spend after we have seen that bid were, bids were working couple of bids for doesn't work we just killed them and decided to not touch it for at least three four days those two campaigns and left only three ad sets one in the main campaign and two in the bid campaigns with two different bids for four days and that's started you know, spending just consistently and give us this kind of results before end of the month then we start duplicating and in the main campaign we start increasing the budget every single day from 30 to 50 dollars if it was working we increasing more if it not we were decreasing back so we were playing just vertical surfing scaling with the main campaign and the duplicated campaign with the bit strategy we haven't touched it for for a while so well, after that uh till today have been generated again uh 28,900 and all just because we were using first of all chat gpt for the high conversion rate if conversion rate would be 1.5 2 percent we would be we would be barely on 18 22 percent margin maximum but because we were playing with the different brainstormings for this particular uh product of this chat gpt we were able to get find find out the best name for the product the best hooks the best approach and the best ad copies which we can generate and for even for the videos the scripts has been used by the team but we were making just perfect by sending the script to the chat gpt and asking hey give us the perfect script for this particular text so basically this is what has been done the main point is conversion rate plus the tiktok strategy which is uh, super simple you have to give it time you have always give couple of days to tiktok if you got the first sale and the first day give the chance to tiktok and after that kill what doesn't work and give it another day or two and this is what happens you see sometimes we cannot see the uh, winners on the facebook if you live like that most probably it's not not a winner because facebook start giving almost instantly in the first two three days for you some kind of results which is showing to you okay this product have makes makes sense but in tiktok sometimes it give you one random sale or two random sales and people are killing it because it's not profitable on them not day number two but with TikTok, you need to give a bit time, and that what usually happening uh, when you just working on the, your stuff by implementing several tools and making sure that the store is gonna be performing under the right way. So manage your store wisely. If you have any kind of questions, please leave the comments below, and I will be happy to answer to you. And see you in another video.